my crazy mom. Oh, oh man, my crazy, crazy mom. So she did, when I was a teenager, I had a car, which uh, was quite a burden for a teenager working part-time. Uh, I didn't get help with gas or insurance or repairs. So it was, it was, it was a real struggle. It was pretty much all the money I made went to keeping a car, which is such an American thing to do. When the car uh, finally died, um, she allowed me to ride my stepdad's motorcycle. Now, I have a 16-year-old in the house, and I would not consider letting him ride a motorcycle, but maybe times have changed. And this bike, it was was nice-ish. I mean, it wasn't anything exciting. It was a 250 Yamaha, just a normal street bike from the 70s. And uh, it'd been sitting for a long time. So it had a really slick back tire that tires had kind of, you know how an eraser gets really hard? The tire had gotten really hard and it was very slick. And uh, I tipped it over at least twice because just in normal riding, the back end would just slip out, just turn a corner and just on your ass, sliding across the pavement. So for my birthday, I asked for, I said, I, I'll tell you what I really want. I want a new back tire. Now, I don't know what a motorcycle tire cost back then. $50, $100, I have no idea. And uh, so instead, she got me a a $20 watch for my birthday. Because safety safety be damned. And what actually, it was great when I was a little older, uh, I needed to buy... That motorcycle died. Those were... They famously had a problem with locking up from the oil pump going bad. It doesn't matter. Uh, when it died, she agreed to loan me money to go out and buy another motorcycle. Who, who, why, who? She's like, it'll be fun. You can get something that's really attractive and nice. It'll, it'll be cool. And I'll pay for your gas. You can, you can use Steve's gas that he has for all the lawnmowers. We'll pay for your gas if you ride a motorcycle. What a weird incentive. And the motorcycle insurance was much cheaper because the amount of damage you can cause is pretty much limited to yourself. So yeah, she bought, she encouraged me to buy a motorcycle. Who does that? That's crazy. But for that matter, when my brother turned 18, she offered to buy him a one-way ticket to Hawaii. He could sleep on the beach. He could have an adventure. And again, I'm not saying that's, Uh, That would be life-changing. That would be transformative. That might be the most important, exciting thing that ever happened in your life. But who does that? Who offers that for their kid? I mean, at least offer a return trip at some point. Nope. You go to Hawaii, you stay in Hawaii. Sayonara, sucker. So weird. Man, my mom was crazy.